Inside this comprehensive step-by-step -step video tutorial, we are going to show you how you can create, manage, and maintain your own website on WordPress from scratch without learning how to code. WordPress is the most popular content management system, CMS, and powers more than 30% of websites. With its beautiful designs, powerful features, and the freedom to build anything you want it is both free and priceless at the same time. And you are going to learn everything there is to learn to kick off your web presence with WordPress successfully. So let's get started. WP Training Kit Video Number 1 How to Buy Domain Name Part 1 Inside this video training, we are going to show you how you can buy your domain name step by step. Let's have a look. Okay, so we are buying our domain name from GoDaddy. This is a welcome page with the URL GoDaddy.com. Just type it in the search bar, GoDaddy.com, and here we are. So inside its search bar, we are going to search our preferred domain name. We want to buy WPTrainingKit.com. So type it in there and enter search. So it opens with the details, showing me that it's available. Scroll down a little bit and you'll see the name with different extensions and their price. You can choose whatever you want. So I am going to buy WPTrainingKit.com. And here's the Add to Cart option. And here it is showing me an option to include WPTrainingKit.us for just $1. If you want it, you can click this checkbox, but I'm going to proceed without it. So let's click the Add to Cart button for WPTrainingKit.com. Now it's added to my cart, and here on top, I am going to click on this Continue to Cart button. It redirects me to the checkout page. Here it is showing me an offer of privacy protection for $9.99 per year. There's another security option and then no thanks option if you want to skip those. So for privacy protection, it's $9.99. And here you can see the details. Click on it and a pop-up kind of box appears. It will show you what it will do, like hide your personal info, prevents domain spams, Stop Domain Hijacking, Protecting Against Stalkers and Harassers. Just like that, you can see details of other options also by this same process. So here it is showing. Okay now, so I am going to add this privacy protection option. I will click on this radio button. Scrolling down, here is the option to create a new email address with my domain name and it's for $1.99 per month. You can also add it, but we are going to proceed with just our domain name and privacy protection. Click on this to continue to cart button and it redirects me to another page. Here I can select the duration of my domain name registration. If I select it for one year, it is showing me one year price and a little lower, here is my subtotal. After adding taxes and fees, here is my total payable amount. On the left, it is showing me an offer to buy matching domains, .co and .info, etc. So now to complete my purchase, I have to sign in. If you are a new user, you can create your account, or if you already have an account, you can simply click on Sign In. I will click on Create Account button, and the Sign Up page opens. Here you need to fill the credentials. I am going to put my email address, username, and a strong password of my choice, and it should be of at least nine characters password. Okay, so here is my password. You can view it from here. Your password at least nine characters. Make sure you create a strong password. Then click on Create Account button. So the account is created and here it requires additional details for billing, like country. Select your country here, your name, phone number, address, city, organization, tax ID, and click on Save button. Or you can check out quicker with PayPal, 
if you click on this button. It will take you directly to step three, and then there will be step four that will complete your process. So here we are on step three payment option, where I have to enter my card details, and lower here is the option to proceed with PayPal. I'm going to use it. Click on PayPal radio button, and it is showing me what PayPal policies it is using. Here I have to enter my account's nickname, which is completely optional. This checkbox here will use PayPal as my backup payment method for this account. Take a look at additional options. So yes, now we are going to click on this Authorize on PayPal button, and it is directing us to PayPal login page. Here we need to insert our PayPal ID and password to continue. I am putting my credentials here and then click on Login. Thank you for watching. Please proceed to video number two, which is a continuation video of this How to Buy Domain Name video. We will proceed with our payment procedures and complete our domain name purchase. See you in the next tutorial.